Good afternoon, plant the seed and you shall receive. You know, I like saying that before I start my video. Um, today, I would like to just, you know, come on here and let, let you guys know to just continue to believe. Um, continue to believe that God is going to work things out. You know, continue to believe that whatever you're asking God to do in your life, um, continue to ask God to just cover you. Um, to lead you and guide you in every step that you take in life. Um, I just thank God for just blessing me, you know, blessing me on my journey. I've been doing YouTube now for about, I want to say consistently. Um, it's been two years now, two years. And I believe that God has definitely been, you know, working with me, um, touching me. And I believe that he has angels um, surrounding me every day. I just want to let you guys know that, you know, whatever your whatever your dreams are, whatever you're asking God to do, just continue to believe um, that God is going to bring you through. Um, just trust him in this time, because I believe that God has definitely blessed me. Um, I believe that he's not done with me, and I believe that he is still in the blessing business. So I believe that if you're watching this video right now, and, and you hear me talking and giving you the word of encouragement, um, just go ahead and hit that thumbs up, because I believe God is definitely going to bless you. Um, like I always say, I'm not on here um, for fake for for just um what do I want to say how do I want to say it um I'm not on here to just gas you guys up um I'm on here to let you guys know that God is real and if you speak to him if you believe it if you receive it then um God can open up doors for you all you have to do is believe it you know I was told you know in my life all you have to do is just continue to have faith. Have faith in what you believe in. If you believe God is going to do it, if you believe he's going to work it out, then everything else is history. You know, I just trust God and believe that um, he's going to bless each and every individual that is trusting in him, that is believing, and that and that receives um Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior. And I just want to say to you guys, just continue to trust God in all you do. If, as long as you keep it real with yourself and you keep it real with God and you just continue to just walk in in God's um walk in God's favor, he's he will bless you. And I know God is definitely in the blessing business. Um God is never at rest. He is always blessing people. He's always healing people. He's always giving out strength. Um, and I just ask right now for you guys to continue to trust God. Continue to trust God. I know um, my YouTube channel is not big, but I believe one day God is definitely going to bless my YouTube channel as long as I stay faithful, as long as I just continue to keep it real. Um, and I just believe that he's going to do some great things. And I'm just letting you guys know if you continue to just trust God, if you continue to just believe that he's going to work everything out, everything that you ask for. In Jesus' name, it shall come. And I'm, I'm just going to continue to bring you guys the word. I'm going to continue to allow God to use me. Um, I always pray before I do anything because I believe um, that God um, always uses me. He always uses me. And every, and every time that I feel the spirit moving... Um, I just have to release it. I have to release um, the energy. I have to let you guys know how good God has been to me because I look over my life and I, I realize how good how good God has been to me. 
you know, in the life that I used to live, the life I chose before I, I turned my life over to Christ, it was it was a dead end road for me with that lifestyle that I was living. And I'm glad that God had he touched me. I'm glad God had touched me. He saw me and he said, you know what? It's time for you to do um, what I've been calling you to do. And I am just so thankful and grateful that God had took me away from that lifestyle. You know, he blessed me. Um, he showed me a different, a different way to go. Because if you think about it, if you continue living the same lifestyle that you've been living and you know that it's not right, eventually it's going to come to an end. But how I look at it is whatever you do for Christ, whatever you do for God, it will last not just one day, but it will last forever. And God, when God's word goes forth, it never turns back void. So. I'm just going to continue to, you know, follow God. I'm going to continue to believe that he's going to bless me. I'm going to continue and believe that um, he's going to work everything out no matter how hard it gets, no matter how the how the um how the road looks ahead. I'm just going to continue to give God the praise and give him the glory because I know for a fact that God has brought me a mighty long way. And I'm sure he has brought you a mighty long way. And I can't speak for you. I can only speak for me because I know how far God has brought me. I know where I could have ended up. But God kept his hands on me. Um, and I'm just thankful and I am grateful. And I'm just going to continue to believe. I'm going to continue to believe that God is getting ready to do some great things. And if he did it before, I know he can do it again. A lot of people get so um, down and out when when bad things happen. But you got to remember to trust God in the middle of your storm. Because if you look at it, if God did it back then, then he can do it now. If you already already been through what you're already going through, then God can bring you out of it. Just like he brought you out of it a long time ago, he can bring you out of it again. But you got to remember that you have to continue to trust God. You have to continue to believe in him. You have to continue to speak good things over your life. You have to, you have to speak life over death. Because Satan, all he wants to do is kill, steal, and destroy. And God wants to bless you. He wants you to have life and have it more abundantly. And all he asking for you is to trust him, trust him in your time of need, believe that God will work things out. And, you know, in, the, in this month of May, I'm believing, I'm believing that God is going to do some great things, not only for me, but each and every individual that believes in Christ Jesus that is watching this video right now, I'm believing God is getting ready to bless you like he's never blessed you before. And all you have to do is believe. Like I always tell you guys, the name of my channel was called Plant the Seed and You Shall Receive. And all you have to do in this season is plant the seed and you shall receive all God's blessings. He loves you and he wants to be a part of your life. So the message I'm bringing you guys to this evening is believe. Believe that God is going to work out everything that you're asking for. Faith. Work without faith is dead. So you have to work towards what you're asking God to do. Because God is not just going to bless you if you're not working towards it. You know, you have to work towards it because you have to believe that God is going to bless you. But you also have to put in the work. Faith without work is dead. So put in the work. Believe God is going to bring you out. Believe God is going to give you strength. Believe God is going to heal your family. Believe God is going to bless you tremendously and abundantly. You just have to continue to believe that God is going to do everything that you ask him to do. Just continue to um, believe. I love you guys. I thank each and every one of you guys that are watching the videos that are with me in this ministry. Um, we're going to continue to trust God. And I just want to say thank you to each and every one of y'all. Thank y'all for watching. Thank you guys for being faithful. I love you guys. God loves you more. Um, before we end this, um, let's uh, say a quick prayer. I might get cut off. I'm not sure how long my video is going to last, but um, we're going to believe. 
that God is going to work it out. Father God, I come saying thank you. Thank you for your people, Father God. I ask right now that you touch each and every individual that is watching this video, Father God. We're believing in this season, Father God, this month, Father God of May, that you're going to do everything that we're asking, Father God, as long as we trust you, Father God, as long as we believe, Father God, that you are going to do each, that you are going to bless each and every one of these individuals that is watching this video right now. Father God, we ask right now that you just lead them, Father God, that you guide them, that you take away their pains, Father God. Take away um, all of their bad situations, Father God. I ask right now that they trust you, Father God, in their time of needs, Father God. Father God, we rebuke Satan right now in the name of Jesus, Father God. We ask right now that you take away, Father God, what needs to be taken away, Father God. And we ask, Father God, that you just come into these individuals' lives and that you just cover them in your blood, Father God. We thank you, Father God, for sending your son, Jesus Christ, down to die on the cross for our sins. We give you all the praise. We give you all the glory glory. Heavenly Father, we just say thank you for what you're doing. Thank you for what you're getting ready to do in, in this season, Father God. We love you, we thank you, and we praise your holy name. In Jesus Christ's name, we believe that it is done. We declare and we decree. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray. Amen and thank God. Remember, God loves you. Plant the seed and you shall receive. Until next time, you guys be blessed and remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Thank you.